I'm trying to block the wind with a tree. Because it, it, no wind unless I'm recording. As soon as I start recording, the wind just picks up like crazy. But anyway, I'm out here. I found this little pond here. There's also a creek running that way. I'm going to check out. Uh, it, it's weird because there's a neighborhood right there. There's a little baseball field. There's these sidewalks and trails and stuff all over this place. You would think this place is a park. But no, this is actually part of a golf course. Uh, so, But this golf course is closed for a few months so figured it'd be a good time to come sneak in and check it out uh, i'm gonna fish this pond for a little bit i don't know if there's any fish in it or not i know there's fish in the creek so hopefully we'll pull something out today let's get to it They're renovating the golf course or something. So they're, there's construction crews and stuff out here all the time. And I, I'm not entirely sure exactly what they're doing, but doing a lot of work to it. And it looks like they're putting in new golf cart trails and stuff. Okay. And it looks like I'm standing in what's supposed to be a small little pond. There's a pipe here in the middle that goes I don't even know how deep that is it's probably like five six feet deep and then there's another pipe that flows into it there's another pipe right over here and then a bunch of pipes laying around up there so it looks like this was a pond because there's I mean you can tell by the way the ground is right here like you can see where the water line was and the, the, it had water in it for a long time this is what, the, what it looks like when you drain a pond it's nice Deep, fairly deeper stretch than the rest of the creek. There's got to be something hanging around over here. Yep, there we go. Sunfish. It's like a little green sunfish. No? Maybe not. A better one. Oh, he swallowed it. Choked it. There we go. That was pretty quick, so I'm not even going to turn the camera off. Just throw another one out there. And look at that. As soon as it hits the water, they, they're just blowing up on it. It's all these green sunfish. Just as soon as it touches the water, they're, they're inhaling it. I would like to catch something else, but I mean, I've got some green sunfish, so I've got a video out of it. There's another one. Man, they are just choking it, too. That's what, four or five already? Three, four? I don't know. Just keep throwing until we get another one. See, look at that. That one didn't get the hook though. There we go. Just about every cast. This, well, every single cast, yeah, as soon as it hits the water, they're just taking it. There's another one. They're fighting pretty hard, I'll give them that. They're not very big, but they feel like they're a lot bigger than they are.
I guess they're just sitting over here. Nope, they're over here too. That one slipped off, but yeah. All right, this here kind of explains why I haven't seen any bass and just green sunfish because it cuts off over here. So it's just solid concrete that's all dry. And then this creek, which is really basically a pond because it's not flowing anywhere. And then it gets cut off over here again. So there's not really a way for the bass to get up in this direction. So it looks like it's just going to be sunfish up here. So I actually drove by here this morning at like 6 a.m. And the construction workers were just coming into work. It is now 7 p.m. and the construction workers are still here. There's bulldozers and stuff straight ahead of me over there. So I kind of have to change directions and go back. I don't want to walk right into the middle of all that. But I am going to try something else. I'm, I'm going to get back to my truck and drive around to the other side and park somewhere else because there's another pond. Uh, well, I mean... Because there were several small little water hazards, so I don't really want to call them ponds, like this right here. Like, clearly it didn't hold enough water to, to contain a population of fish. So, if this, these are drained, there was another pond that I knew about over there that looked like it might have been fishable. But they might have drained that as well. It looks like they've drained everything, pretty much. I was planning on fishing this and checking out a couple of different ponds that I know are in this golf course, but it would appear that they've drained the ponds you know, with whatever kind of renovation project they're working on. Yeah. So all the ponds are drained, except for this one over here and, uh, and the creek. So, I mean, most of the fish were in the creek anyway, but I fished this creek before downstream on the other end of the golf course outside of the golf course in the park i fish this creek all the time so i wanted to try something different and right now i'm driving around the golf course and i'm looking to see if there's another pond because there was another pond over here and it, it doesn't look like there's any water in it looks like they've drained it and yeah so uh, yeah, they've drained the pond that I wanted to fish, so, oh wait, look, there's a pond. Hmm. I'm, let me go check that one out for a few minutes. Let me do a quick U-turn up here. Right by the road over here, I'm actually right by the entrance, and then there's like the road that goes up to the clubhouse over here. So I'm only going to be here for a few minutes because these people that work here are probably going to be coming out anytime now. Some activity on that other side over there. Turtles it looks like. Yep, turtles. Maybe in the middle, it's like three to four feet deep, so. Not entirely sure why, but there's like a rope just strung out from the middle, hanging out, floating on the surface there. And then what looks like power lines going into the water, so. One over there, one over here. I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and go, and since I didn't catch anything today, well, I mean, I caught sunfish, but nothing substantial. I'm going to go ahead and splice in some footage from the last time I went fishing where I didn't really catch anything substantial, but a bunch of little bass. So enjoy that, and then see you next time. Thanks for watching. I forgot my polarized again. I actually found them, though. I thought I'd lost them somewhere. Well, I almost well, I moved my truck earlier. Yeah. <laughs> See if something wants a chopper today. He read on trolling back to the <laughs> There we go. Ah. And it's a bass too. Right. And it's not a guad. Surprisingly. Right.
He's hooked right where you want to hold him. Yeah, <laughs> I can't get a good hold on him because of that. No, here, I'm going to manhandle you. Yeah. Happy now? You're not supposed to do that, man. It's bad for the fish if you touch them. Right. Cute little bass. Later. I'm sure there's some hanging out on this side, actually. Let me try under this tree. I don't know this is just wide enough to where I don't want to jump it. It's the same as all the other ones. It just looks a little deeper. Look at that, right there. As soon as it hit the water. They're all guads hanging out in the faster water over here. <laughs> oh, I just stepped across. I didn't even have to jump. This might be, might be one of the, the best looking spots in the whole river. <laughs> Shallow, but still. <laughs> oh look, and there's a bottle of water over here for me. It's not even open. Oh, there we go. Oh, I thought it was going to be better than that. my biggest one of the day oh man I think there's one big one hiding over here even though it's real shallow he's got like a fort, a fort made of rocks, big rocks that he's in. And that's not him, but I got one. The swim bait. Really? Yep. The chomper should work fine. As cool as this area is and how it looks, it's just really too shallow right here. So I think we need to move down a little farther. So I gotta get back over there and try to get downstream some. Cause I mean, there's a lot of fish right here, but they're all a little tiny four or five inch wads. Jeez. I'm over here stepping up high thinking I'm going to climb up, but it's just really thick, dead grass. <laughs> oh, wow. Never knew this was here. I, like, I wonder if there's actually fish in it. <laughs> Don't need to get down there. Oh, there's definitely fish in it. Got one on the first cast. Oh, he came off. Oh. What's up? What is it, raspberry? Raspberries. Are they actually raspberries? I think they are. I think the ones over there on your side. Eat it. Tastes like burning. Need a little more. <laughs> need a little more burning? No, I mean, they need a little more. A little. Oh. You can taste the sweetness, but not quite there yet. <laughs> well, my battery died before I could catch one, but yep, there's definitely fish in this hole down here. It's an interesting little spot. This guy choked my swim bait. 